This is Stevie. Stevie the cat. But you probably can't see very well right there. Is that he's sucking on my earlobes. It's his thing. It's very, very cute and fairly irritating at the same time. Um, but, you know, he's my little dude. He's my little buddy. He's always around. So we chill together. Having a little session today because it's overcast and rainy and... I woke up with my my hip really hurting like crazy, which hasn't happened in a while, actually. Um, so it was a bit surprising. So I had to medicate a little more than I really wanted to, um, in part because I've been unable to acquire any of Tweed's Lot 3, which I like during the day because it's all CBD. And instead I've had to have some of the Devon, uh, which has got goodly... Oh, see, Stevie? There's my boy. Oops. You're done, huh? I'm You're out? My fault. It's okay. Early. Um, yeah, so now I can talk. Um, yeah, and, uh, what was I saying? I was in pain, and I woke up in pain for the first time in a while because it's wet and rainy. And, uh, yeah, that's what I was saying, is I couldn't get the lot three because uh, they didn't have any in stock. So I had to get some of the Devon, which is really good stuff, but it's got a little more THC in it than I like when I need to function. So while it's got the, the necessary amounts of CBD, it leaves me more than a little hazy. Um, That'll change with time as my tolerances change, I'm sure, but it would have been nice to just been able to pick up the uh, the, the lot three, <coughs> which is very, very low THC. That's a more appropriate medication, and this is part of the problems with the Canadian LP system is that they're regulating the amount of growing happening so much so that we as patients are unable to get the strains of the varieties that that work best for us and it's it's a well-known thing that you know everybody reacts differently to cannabis so there's a lot of trial and error involved and when you find something that works you want to you want it to be available you want to be able to get it you want to be able to turn off the pain and well that's just you know a real solid part of the problem. The upside is though is the pricing's not too bad, although I will be endlessly pleased if I'm given an, an announcement that ODSP is now going to cover it along with their other prescriptions. Um, I, I'm not holding my breath there. But uh, Anyway, I lost my train of thought. Sorry. Again, this is again part of the problem why I don't prefer to, to use the Devon during the daytime when I'm trying to be a little functional, but that's really all I was able to get. See, we're not all a bunch of, you know, fucked up people running around looking for a stone all the time. I've been put in a place where I have to be high because that's what I need to have to turn the pain off. And that's just wrong. It needs to be fixed. Talk to y'all later. Insert catchphrase here.